Okay. Okay, here we sit. We're on the Kenai River. Man, affectionately known as Big Will. We're fishing for a sockeye salmon species today. I can smell them. They're, it's, usually they're very rare in the Kenai. However, when you spent... 325 <laughs> days out of the year, they're pretty rare. <laughs> 320, that's right. But for that extra, how many ever from 325, from 364, 365, I can't really count like that. You get them like this. He's got his. He's got a special t uh, fly he tie. He ties these by himself. He uh, began flying uh, tying flies after his uh, his <laughs> after his. Ah, uh, like, like he might have one. Holy smokes! Sockeye salmon. There we go. Look at look at. He's running. Those fish range from four to about sixteen pounds. Big will. <laughs> He's got one. He's got one right by the keister. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Look at the way it's coming in today. I'm not it's quite sure. Not Here he comes. Okay, that was a hook and release there. That's a professional release. <laughs> okay. Well, Carol was coming to help. We had we had recruitments. But he but it got off. Got off this time. So he's gonna give her another twirl here. It's a few boats on the river. Actually, pretty tough to catch. There's there's a few guys down below us catching a few. Will and I've been at this. Uh, came out the other day, caught a few. Just about have our limit today. Just about we've just about reached our limit today. You notice that technique? Watch the technique. Elbows in. Very good Sims technique, if you know what that means. Elbows in, rod tip down. He's ready. A little line gathered up in his left hand. And you just follow through. <laughs> Look at him. He needs to, actually, he needs to bend his knees just a little bit to get a little bit more uh, pounce situation going. You know, oh! Oh, darn it. Looks like I got he... the professional putt putt golf stance going. <laughs> He just follows that rod tip down, follows her down. And that hook is sharp, and it needs to be in the something soft and fleshy. Unlike my ear. <laughs> yeah, in the ears, eyes, nose, throat. Those aren't good places for hooks. However, you might be able to YouTube some spots where, <laughs> where, you, where you see some fellas putting hooks into soft, fleshy parts of their body. Oh, that just sounds awful. Ah, yeah. There he goes. It's probably the most he's, most casts he's made without sticking one. Holy moly, Eddie! I know it's about six casts. Just a, it just doesn't look like you're concentrating very well. <laughs> you need to loosen up, loosen up a little bit here. You're just stand right out of the line of fire now. Yeah. Shake that one off. <laughs> that was a near miss. There's a, there's a way to edit that stuff, huh? I think there's a way to edit it. You can take out a couple casts. Oh, Eddie, it was bouncing. <laughs> it was bouncing. <laughs> this, is, this is Will Jerk. He's actually a legend on the Kenai. Right here, all the way from the all the way from the Kenai Lake. Oh, ah! 
Oh, I've seen it. You're just out of the corner. It's out of the corner of my eye. You need to get work on your reflexes just a little bit. I got all this pressure <laughs> There it is. Oh. It's too much pressure. You gotta concentrate a little. <laughs> you gotta concentrate a little. But not this much usually. Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. He's using about a six weight, seven weight fly rod. Seven. You got a set seven, number seven. Seven weight, ten footer. Ten foot number seven. It's a Gary Loomis. It's about twenty seven and a half years old, I think. I didn't, I didn't think Gary Loomis was twenty seven. I traded a car and a firstborn <laughs> for it. So he only he only f presently has two children. Yeah. <laughs> one, of one of them's working in a sports goods store. <laughs> but he has an awful lot of fishing poles, so I think he might have been the breeder. Ah, oh, there it is. There it is. Damn it! Damn it! <laughs> oh man! Too much pressure! <laughs> oh, they're in there ready to bounce it on my line. Are they're they? Clear. <laughs> That's what we've been doing. Now he's in a poised position. They are nice. Little overcast today. Beautiful. Look at that rod. Look at him pour the coals to that one. See, that's, that's why we give our children up for our fishing poles, so they can bend like that and not break. I'm telling you, firstborn is a deal. <laughs> it's a bargain. <laughs> we need to go to the tackle shed. We'll see what he's named these fishing rods. <laughs> Michael right now is so happy he was, I guess, secondborn or something. That's right. <laughs> and he just goes, I want a fishing pole. <laughs> I'm playing them in, Eddie. I'm playing them in, babe. Look at the size of that rock There he is. We have plenty of fish. The fisherman. Look at how he's cradling him. Still in the water. Cradle. Just like a little baby. Four. Four sips, the hook is out. It's a, it's a process. Of, oh, and it's oh, a clean release. Oh, there he goes. On for the video. There he goes. Hello, mama. There's a nice one. There's bigger ones in there. Very nice. <laughs> 